Hey, hey, my friend, welcome back to my channel. I am so glad to have you in my channel today as we kick off some exciting DIYs project. I am always on the lookout for new ideas and ways to improve my content and share it with you guys. If you enjoy my videos, please consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell that you will not miss any update. Let's get started on some awesome DIYs project for spring. It's just around the corner and I'm excited to share with you these two beautiful DIY projects that will bright anyone in your home. In this video, we show you to create two beautiful wall decor using wood that you can find in Dollar Tree. For the first one, we will be using this wooden wall can and this square sign that we got from Dollar Tree. We will be adding this beautiful uh, scrapbook paper to cover the square sign as we grant for the, uh, our DIY. We are tracing out to cut it out and to cover the square sign on the front with this uh, white glow or clear glow. Right now, I'm mixing some drops of brown Riverly wax and white paint to get beige color and paint the wall can. I like this color. Take your markers and start coloring in the flower design that is already on top of this wooden wall can. You can use any color that you like, but I suggest using bright and cheerful colors that are perfect for spring. Take your time with these steps and make sure that your color in the details on the flowers. I have this red marker just all around the flowers and some uh, dark pink inside this uh, flowers. Make it more darker with the red marker. Voila. We continue coloring all the details on top of this water can until we get the, the design that we want. We color these leaves with a green marker too. Also the welcome mm, sign on top of the water can. Color it with this burgundy marker. Adding some uh, white dots with this paint all around this work. We have been adding these two paint sticks and painted them with beige paint to add them as borders to square sign. We add this uh, sticker border and paint them together with beige paint. Let them dry and glue them on the two sides of the square sign with the wood glue and hot glue. Let them dry on the side. We have these small fences. Now that flowers are colored, it's time to add some details like these wooden fences that we got from Dollar Tree. We got these uh, small wooden fences and color them with the same markers to add some details to this garden sign. We have this green, pink, red. Also, I've been using these jingle blacks. We have four of them. Paint them with beige paint to add some dimension to our fences and let them dry. It's time to create the dotted effect using toothbrush with white paint. Just hold the toothbrush and run your finger over the bristle to create a spattering of white dots on top of this water can and let it dry. Now we are adding these uh, jingle blocks with uh, wood glue and hot glue and glue the fences on top of each block like that. Adding some elevation to these fences. And one Jenga block on, on the back of this fence. It's time to add these uh, paper flowers that I have in my scratch. So add them in the center of each flower. 
We are hot gluing this piece of twine to hang this spring hole decor. Before we hang it, we hot glue some tiny ID bags that we got from Dollar Tree. We add them on top of this uh, tiny mm -hmm. fences like that. Look at how it turned out. Hey voila, we have created a beautiful spring wall decor using this wooden wall can. This DIY project is perfect for adding a touch of spring to any room in your home. What do you think guys? Let me know in your comment below. What do you think about this project? And then, 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 then. So look at these bright colors. I love them. And jump to the second DIY. Before we start the second project, I am excited to share with you all about the collaboration that I am thrilled to be a part of. It's called What Would You Make? and it's hosted by two amazing creators, Zina from OK Home DIY and Connie from Connie's Creative Creations. They are joined this month by our co-host Malika from Malika Creations. She brings a fresh perspective to the collaboration and can't wait to see what she made. Each of these talented creators will be sharing an incredible DIY project within Wood and they can't wait to see what they came out with. You can check out the channels by clicking the links in the description box below. And make sure to check out the What Would You Make playlist also linked in the description box below. You will enjoy watching my crafty friends making beautiful and amazing DIYs. Use it wood. Let's jump to the second DIY now. Pom, pom. The second project we are going to be showing you how to create a beautiful wall decor using a embroidery hoop with some flowers and piece of tool that you got from Dalachi. This is a super easy and affordable DIY project that you can create in just a few simple steps. So uh, we have the embroidery hoop. Take the small part of the embroidery hoop and place it down on flat surface. Then we cut a piece of uh, tool that is slightly larger than the embroidery hoop. Since our our tool, or we can use VL tool, so our tool is not larger enough. So we cut two pieces and put them together to make a larger piece. Time to add uh, the flowers to the tool. Choose your favorite flowers. You can also use dried flowers and glue them to the center of the VL or the, the tool. Arrange them in a way that looks uh, pleasant to you. Once you have added the flowers, cover them with another larger piece of the tool. Make sure the tool is centered over the flowers. The final step is to add the other larger part of the embroidery hoop on top to close it and make it like a floating flowers while decor. Press down firmly to ensure that the hoop is secure and in place. Like that. So, -na -na -na. Then you can cut out the excess of this uh, tool with scissors all around this uh, embroidery hoop and add some hot glue on the back of this hoop to, to make sure that it is adhered there. Voila, all around. Add this beautiful bow on top with this uh, paper flower in the center of this bow with piece of twine to hang it. Et voila! And there you have it, a beautiful floating flower wall decor that you can create in just a few simple steps. This DIY project is perfect for adding a touch of elegance in any room in your home. What do you think, guys? Uh, let me know in your comment below what do you think about these two projects, about this video, and thank you so much for watching, and see you soon. A bientôt. Bye.